Hi, welcome back. Earlier, I set you two sequence puzzles. Did you solve them? The first one is this one here. Sent. Actually, don't do that. Don't read it out. That is just distracting. The fun of these puzzles is that you look at it and you think, oh my God, it looks like someone's writing something, but actually it's not that at all. I started with saying that David noticed S-E-N-T. Where might S-E-N-T occur? Well, think about it. I mean, this is a math blog. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Sound familiar? But what about the T's? And then the penny drops. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, goes on 29, 30, which also begins with a T, to 39. What comes after 39? 40, which begins with an F. So the letter that comes after here is an F. And now for the second puzzle. How would you go about solving this? Well, the first thing that you want to realize is that I'm not asking you to find the number that comes afterwards. I'm just asking you for the pattern. And there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve numbers. And then you see that actually it's every number from one to twelve is included. So it's an ordering of one to twelve. What do we know that come in twelves? Buns? No, months of the year. So let's think what's the fourth month? April. What's the eighth month? August. It's the two months that begin with an A. I wonder if there's a clue there. The twelfth month, December, begins with a D, again at the beginning of the alphabet. And once you carry on, you realise quite quickly that this is an ordering of the months alphabetically. I hope you enjoyed these puzzles. I'll be back in two weeks with a completely different sort of puzzle. See you then.